Our sense of hearing is really fast, perhaps even faster than our vision, which may be a little bit surprising. So what do we mean by fast in terms of hearing? I'm talking about our brain's ability to separate very short sounds from each other, compared to very short images. Let's start with the speed of our vision. Take an old silent movie, for example. We find it jerky because it was made of fewer images per second than modern film. Our brains are simply fast enough to identify the film's individual images. It's different with modern film. At 24 frames per second, we can't distinguish individual images. Instead, we see a smooth and seamless film. We can therefore say that the human visual time resolution is about 40 milliseconds, at least with film. Tests have shown that we're able to see a stroboscopic effect of light at 25 milliseconds. So, what's our lowest time resolution for sound? Can we tell sounds apart at a time resolution of 25 milliseconds or less? as with stroboscopic light. Let's find out. We start with a sound of a time resolution of 500 milliseconds. Not too hard to hear individual sound pulses, right? Let's try the time resolution of modern film, 40 milliseconds. It still sounds choppy, which means we can still tell individual sound pulses apart. Let's crank it up one more notch. This is 20 milliseconds, faster than the world record for vision. It's beginning to sound like a smooth sound, but isn't it still a bit choppy? This is 10 milliseconds. Now it's definitely a smooth sound, so we have clearly passed the limit or our hearing's time resolution. But still, it's faster than our vision. Our fast hearing is useful to us. When a sound wave hits us, it reaches one ear just before the other. Our brain is fast enough to interpret this time difference as the direction to the sound source, along with the sound level, of course. In hearing protectors, we use microphones and electronics to recreate this directional sensitivity.